much for staying with the Monday report. So two families in Mudurwa market in Nairobi are appealing to security agencies to help trace their loved ones who were allegedly abducted by unknown men in broad daylight at the market three months ago. Benson Kimani, who operated a hardware at the market, and Jackson Karaoke, a property dealer, were allegedly kidnapped outside Kimani's hardware after shopping for items in Isili. Detectives at Kamkunji Police Station are currently investigating the matter. Nancy Modhoni and Rosalyn Wamboi take a brief break from their workstations at Modura Market to chat and reflect on their three-month struggle to locate their husbands. The two friends and their children have gone to almost all corners of the country in search of their spouses, 52-year-old Benson Kemani and 58-year-old Jackson Karaoke, who were allegedly kidnapped by unknown men who were driving a Subaru on June 29th at 2 p.m. <laughs> kuelea vitu ya ya kuuza hii ya hardware msee wa, wanafiki yangu sasa walifika hapo 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 wakasikwa lakini wajirani majirani wako sufulika wako sufulika juu walifika walishikwa emergency na wakabaki waka, waka wakiwa stranded niliona huyu mama amekuja huyu rafiki yangu akakuja akaniambia msee wamesikwa nikuja nifuge kazi nikamuliza na simu kwani hayesi nipigie simu they visited three police stations within Nairobi on the fateful day, but the two were nowhere to be found. Days turned into weeks, weeks into months, but their loved ones never returned home and have never been traced. Their phones remain switched off and Kemani's shop has closed since then. <laughs> Central Sub-County Police Commander Rafael Kimilu confirmed to Citizen TV that the case was reported at the Kamkonji Police Station and that detectives are still investigating the matter. The two families have appealed to President William Ruto to intervene on the increased cases of mysterious disappearances in the country. Let's talk about politics now. National Assembly Speaker Mo 